So today's book review is on Prison Break by Jason Goldberg. So Jason's book is about how you go from a prisoner mindset to a self-leader mindset. Uh, what I like about the book is that he doesn't see it as a binary thing. He sees it more as a moment-to-moment -moment choice. He gives an example of in his own life when he was being at his most uh, prisoner-like and what he learned from that to get himself out of that and to move him on his path of where he's going now. Uh, in this book, he uses quotes quite a bit, which I like, um, because they give a sense of what the chapter is going to be about. And they also give you something to reflect on a little bit. And um, I quite like that. He also gives the origin of the word circumstance, which I didn't know about before. Um, it comes from the Greek roots of the words for stand around and yeah like when when i read that i was like that makes sense because whenever i am feeling like a victim to circumstance it's that feeling of standing around that i can't actually do anything that i'm stuck where i am uh i guess another thing that helped what i learned from the book was um that growth isn't necessarily something you need to um that you need to uh, beat yourself up about or make yourself do something or try and get yourself to tap into your willpower to get yourself to do something. Um, in this book, Jason looks more at the fact that it's more where you're coming from. So even if you're making the best plans ever, but it's coming from fear, then that will be infused in everything you do. Um, so I think he gave a good example uh, of if you think of a business a business incubator that generally that's where businesses grow they get mentorship they get uh understanding and some love that uh in order for them to grow and there's a certain barrier that you need to cross to get in there so instead of looking at it as looking at it as i need to grow i need to uh in a sense be a prisoner that i need to, to jail myself and to force myself to do stuff you can just look at it from the perspective of being a business incubator um, where you're setting a higher standard for yourself, but you're doing it in more of an energy of just willing to grow, curiosity, um, willing to learn from lessons, humility, that sort of thing. Um, so that will be infused in everything you do then after that for the majority of it. Um, so yeah, he just, he looks at it from the point of view of turn your growth into a game rather than it being something you have to do and you have to learn lessons. You can actually be more creative and more curious and have more fun around it. In the book, I think Jason points more to the fact of enjoying your day to day, enjoying your moment to moment experience and, and at any given moment to realize that you've got a choice in how you show up. So he has, he had an interesting story of how he thinks about it, that there's a whole team of basketball players inside you and they're just waiting for you to call on them um it sounds a little bit um multiple personality disorder but it points more to the fact that you're not um limited in the way you can do things you can always learn stuff and show up differently in in different situations and naturally we already do that he gives a good example of if you think about when somebody's in trouble say if a uh, say a child crosses the road and you see they're going to be hit by a car, you'll automatically change the way you act because you realize that there's an emergency here. You need to act quickly. You need to show up differently. So we already do it in our own lives um, as it is. It's just we mightn't appreciate that we do this. So Jason's actually been on the podcast. He will be on soon. So he's kindly given a free copy of this book, his ebook, and his uh, audio book. So if you click into the link below the video, that'll take you to um, the page where you can sign up for that. Um, so yeah, that's that's what I learned from the book. I'd recommend to give it a read. It's very, it's very simple. There's lots of wisdom in there. Lots of uh, personal examples, different stories that really help. And I think Jason's got a humorous way of going about this work. So I like that. And I, I find that effective too, because when you start learning to laugh at yourself a bit more, it'll drop things drop in a bit better too. So that's the book. Um, if you want to reach out, if you read it before, let me know. Um, so until next time, have fun and enjoy the process.